Hey guys, this is Agostillo with Artwarius.com. Today we're going to be working on our first of many uh, series tutorial. Today's topic is uh, skin retouching without that plastic porcelain look that you see so often in uh, wedding photography. I already went ahead and I have my model pull up here on screen. By looking at it, the first thing I do uh, notice is that it is a little bit crooked. So I'm going to go ahead and use an advanced technique to uh, straighten this out I'll pull my uh, tool palette up here and what I'm gonna do is zoom in on to the eyes from the dot in one pupil to the dot in the next I'll draw my ruler line and then I'll come up here to image rotate canvas and choose the arbitrary menu now from there there's a number that comes up in the uh, angle dialog and that's the number that Photoshop got from that uh, line that I drew all you gotta do is just click OK and then the application is gonna run and I'll straighten it up based on that line from the ruler here you go uh, what I like to do from here is uh, duplicate my layer if you hit control J it should jump ahead one layer copy in the layer you are currently on in this way all all the, the changes that I made from now on I still have my original piece to go back to if uh, you look you'll see that my image is a little bit messy from that uh, rotate that I made so I'm gonna crop it in a little bit tighter Okay, and uh, looking at this model, if you observe the image, you could see there's a lot of uh, wrinkles going on here. And this is a young model, so we want her to look young. So we're going to go ahead and uh, take some years off by removing some of these wrinkles. And if you look, there are some uh, skin sagging as well. So we're going to get rid of get rid of those and um, take some years off this model. If you guys are not familiar, I went ahead. I think I jump ahead a few guys. I am using one of the healing tools. There are three different healing tools here. You got spot healing, uh, healing brush, and the uh, patch tool. Right now, I selected my patch tool. That way I could go ahead and uh, speed through this. One other thing to keep in mind though, if you're um, healing a textured area, you want to sample from another textured area. So you have a nice clean transition. You don't want to sample a uh, textured area with a smooth area because then you'll have something like this. So you want to keep keep your transition very smooth. okay and if you notice right here we don't have a wrinkle but we do have a little bit of a uh, skin sagging going on so I'm gonna go here and just um, remove that and I just took 10 years away from this model And again, some more uh, skin sagging about the mouth.
And already you can see how younger looking the model looked. And by the way, I'm using my uh, my scroll wheel to zoom in and out of this. You could also use the um, control bracket. Um, I'm sorry, the uh, control plus or minus sign to uh, zoom in and out as well. Okay. Now from from here what we want to do is uh we're going to go ahead and um add some levels to this to give the uh, skin a little bit a little bit of a tone. So I pull my um my layers back on screen so you could see I'm going in down to layer style. We'll pull up my levels tool. And if you notice, uh, judging by my histogram, I don't have much shadow action going on until, or highlight rather, until about right there somewhere. And I'm going to do the same for my shadow area. Somewhere about there. Okay, I could also uh, adjust my mid-tone. That looks good to me. Okay, click OK. And then the next thing I'm going to do is give her a little bit of a tan. I'll do that by uh, coming in here again, um, selecting uh, solid color this time. We'll pull my swatch up here so you can see it. Have a swatch. And what I'm going to do is from my swatch, I'm going to uh, choose a skin tone that I want to tan her in. And uh, go ahead and select this one. click OK and now I'm gonna adjust my blend mode if I go down to soft light click OK and then adjust it to maybe let's see somewhere around 30 and there you go before and after just a subtle tan Okay, and uh, there you have it. Here is our before. There is our after. Skin retouching without the porcelain look. Check out artwarius.com for uh, more video tutorials by Augustillo. That's www.artwarius.com.